We're going to go over how to fix the issue with CrowdStrike Windows causing the blue screen of death error. When you get the error, you're going to click into the enter recovery mode, which I'm already in on this PC. We're going to go to troubleshoot, advanced options, startup settings, hit restart, allow the computer to restart, and this is what will allow us to go into safe mode to get rid of that malicious file. Not malicious, but damage file anyway. So we want to hit option 4, enable safe mode, and this will boot straight into safe mode for us. And if you have an auto login user, such as this computer, it will auto log in. If not, it will ask you to log in from that screen. Now I've actually saved a file path on a flash drive because I've had to do this a bunch of times. We're going to navigate to C drive, Windows, System32, Drivers. Is CrowdStrike, and you'll need to be an admin to do this. Okay, so the file we need, and you can search for it right here, is going to be C dash five zeros two nine one. Now, this computer has actually already been fixed, so I've kind of recreated it by saving a generic text document with that exact name here. And all we're going to do is either push delete on the keyboard or right click and press delete and say yes. Now, I've noticed the file doesn't actually disappear right away. So if I hit the X here and I re enter the file name just to verify that it's actually gone and it is gone. Once it's gone, all you need to do is a regular reboot, and that'll go back into regular Windows. You'll be all set.